My trigger finger will be along the slide of the frame. My three fingers are below the trigger guard in a proper solid grip. My thumb of my dominant hand is flagged. As I drive it out and go to a two-hand grip, my four fingers come below the trigger guard, tightly against it, wrapping around the first three fingers. My thumb of my non-dominant hand and meat of my hand lays into the open portion, and then the back thumb lays down on top. My thumb and trigger finger are pointed towards the target. When I need to shoot, I press the trigger as many times as I need. I want to take and move the garment up and out of the way, driving it to the body. I want to drive down deep onto the gun, establishing a proper grip up against the body, rotating towards the threat or the target, driving it out until I hit full extension. Once I hit full extension, I can hit the trigger and press the trigger. When I'm done, finger off the trigger. I can bring it back to the body. I want to get my concealed garment out of the way of the holster, keeping the gun close to the body, driving the hip out, verifying there's nothing in the way of my holster, my shirt, or anything, before I gently and carefully put it away and reconceal the gun. So when we put the gun away, you want to get that shirt, the garment that's in the way, completely out of the way. You want to take the time to look and visually inspect wherever you're putting your gun. There's no loose clothing, anything that could get in the way. So let's say I'm going through my everyday life and I get attacked from an opposite, from some side, from some side of my body. I'm probably going to startle to it. I realize I need to get the gun. I want to move offline, getting the shirt out of the way, establishing a proper grip on the gun, up against the body as I move, extending it out. Once I hit lock, touch the trigger, shooting until I stop the threat. Once I've come back, I'm going to stay in this position and I'm going to look around, verifying I'm safe in all areas. There's no further threat. Once I feel I'm safe, I'm going to again get the shirt back out of the way, tight to the body, keep the gun close to the body as I look, verifying there's nothing between me and the holster so it can't trip the trigger. Holster back up and I'm going to reconceal the gun.